Hi Scorpios, welcome back to iEnigma Scorpio channel. This is Enigma. I'm going to be doing your general reading for January 2024. Happy New Year and we're going to be seeing what is happening around you. Please note this is going to be a general reading so take what resonates and what does not resonate. For accurate personal readings, white spells and premium charge crystals, feel free to reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram and email. All the details are given down below in the description box. Sun on rising or Venus sign Scorpio plus cross watchers can watch this read. someone that is coming with their hand of love there's someone that's going to ask for your hand there's someone that, that's going to lay out their hand there's someone that's going to hold your hand tight and never leave there's someone that is coming is a person of your dreams and you are the person of their dreams this is someone that's going to be extremely romantic loving and caring towards you some of you have already met this person scorpio pisces cancer what a nice star This is someone that has a lot of money. They like to keep things secretive. You might not see this person being very rich, but the truth is, oh my gosh, this person is full of money. The reason why I'm telling you about this is because money is also an important element of our body because it strengthens our base chakra, root chakra. That is the first chakra for solid foundation. If it's not there, there will always be a shaky love. So this is important. This person is fulfilled in life like you are, even more than you. And this is someone that has built a solid foundation. They might not like to talk about it much because they're, of a, they're a person of love. Now, wow, the temperance and the ten of swords. Are you still stuck with someone or this person is definitely into you or this person is coming into your life. But first, stop being in this on and off energy with someone from the past in your head or physically are you still thinking about them are you still thinking about the hurt it does it affect your confidence does it make you feel weak does it make you not fall in love again there are some fears that have been taken down from the past and is helping you not to trust anyone somewhere there is like you have become shaky this person has built a solid foundation but this connection really needs you to build a solid foundation for yourself how to build the trust in others somewhere the emotional part in your system is lacking where you have trust issues when it comes to anyone coming with a love offer so that is something you have to work on right now so finally there's going to be an ending to something that you are still keeping yourself stuck in the ten of swords wow finally you're going to come out of this on and off energy with someone e either energetically or physically you were with someone but now this new relationship is going to take you to another place in your, in the world that you live in, in the environment that you uh, like. This is going to be very different. So you being in this 50-50 energy to becoming complete, satisfied, happy, and not being single anymore, being with someone with whom you will share a kid, depending upon your age. But I'm definitely seeing the fish is also depicting about new vitality, the rainbow. You can see the Ten of Cups. It's not you doing it alone. It's someone with you. You guys living in the same place together. You guys have a kid. You guys are loving each other like anything. It's always like every day is a new love for both of you. And it's a very strong energy of Scorpio Pisces Cancer because I'm seeing a lot of water cards. Scorpio, write down in the comment section. I embrace this union for lifetime and I believe in myself and I will adjust and I will also stay faithful. Page of Swords. This is someone that you might meet through search or they might find you through search. All right. There is a need for you to be more out there. It's not like you sit in this place and you'll be like expecting someone to come on its own towards you. Some sort of efforts are needed from your side because you might be sitting in the same place doing nothing. Wow. 
Now, I'm seeing the two of swords, the seven of swords, the three of pentacles, the four of... Are you being too happy being single in this free state of mind? You don't want to put effort, right? You're comfortable being alone. You're comfortable doing nothing. And you expect someone to come into your life. There is a fear that you need to stop uh, thinking about. There's a fear because you don't want to put efforts. Somewhere I feel like you're tired. You don't want to put efforts. You think everything should come to you like a miracle. It will, but you have to work on it. Okay. This is something they have to be careful with. And you don't even know which way to put efforts. Like you're too confused. I'm also seeing you've been deceived in the past, which is why you have trust issues, serious trust issues. And it's really difficult for you to find this person in your life. So how will this person be coming into your life? The King of Cups, the Queen of Cups. First of all, coming out of your comfortable space and coming out of your victim mindset. That is the biggest roadblocker for you. Okay, when you are in this victim mindset, you will never achieve what you're looking for. So go for a road opener um, uh, prayer if you want to get out of this blocked energy, if you're in this energy, because you have the still thoughts in your mind. Oh, I'm going to be deceived. What's the point? You know, you still have this feeling. So you are basically nourishing your mind and indirectly are giving this message to the universe that you don't deserve it. And that is why universe will interpret it into not giving you anything in return. So do you want that? Change your mindset. Come out of your comfortable space. You will have a very different lifestyle ahead. I'm seeing you socializing. I'm seeing you being a part of groups. I'm seeing you being more um, friendly. I'm seeing you being more open to dating. I'm seeing you being more expressive, being more welcoming. A lot of changes in your life will bring that new age uh, beginning in your life. A completely new cycle you're going to experience. But first, come out of this. Like, really, there's something going on that's not right with you. Maybe you're stuck in a Pisces or something. Because I got the Pisces card. But I'm definitely seeing there is a change in the uh, how you see the world, how you view the world. There is going to be a massive change, a shift in your life within two years' time from now. It take Everything takes time. Four of swords and that strength. You have become so independent and satisfied being alone with your confidence and with your self-worth that you don't really see any need to make efforts to find someone in your life. We should always remain humble, <laughs> right? Right now in the comment section, I am humble from day one. Scorpio. All right. I'm going to take this one. Five of Pentacles. Oh, come out of your comfortable space. Are you trapped in this, um, you know you know this this room you're trapped in this four walled area you don't want to seek somewhere somewhat new you don't want to seek new things in your life you don't want to look for what's new in for me what new things can i learn how i can grow how i can meet new people how i can engage you know you're still in this like running in this energy round and round and round and round and round this is not nice okay so here what do you do how do you work on this? Because you might be very strong and confident, but then you have to also balance your life and make it more available, make yourself more available so that you know how to deal with people at the same time. Some of you, not all. Two pentacles. Start uh, getting involved with a lot of things. And at the same time, try to balance your life with that. Don't try to avoid because you are seeking a uh, comfortable space. Don't do that. Also, multitasking is not a good idea. If you're taking 10, 10 tasks or 2 tasks at one time, don't do that. Happy. You're going to be very happy. You know, every day there's a new and there's a new person, there's a new energy. New person in the sense like sometimes you're talking to your friends, sometimes you're engaging with your person, sometimes you're engaging with your family members. Some uh, Every day there is a new person, new experience, new things, new people. So this is going to make you feel so happy and lively. This is why... You have to be a child all over again to enjoy life, first of all. It's okay. So, you will be part of many celebrations. Counseling is really going to help you. Some of you are counselors yourself. Okay. Some of you are getting counseling, personal readings. These are helping you. Even the general readings that motivate are helping you a lot. 
dwell on what you love do what you feel like doing when you are pushing yourself to do things that you don't love or like you will never get anywhere this is something that i have to tell you to uh, uh, from the bottom of my heart so write down the comment section i believe in myself i do what i like the man holding a coin this came first um, with some other deck as well the king of pentacles your person is someone very rich and successful. There's a possibility that you're reaching out to this person for some counseling and they're the one. Okay, that is possible. That could be a specific message for someone that needs to hear this. 43 age. But what I'm seeing is your person is someone that is definitely very, very rich and successful, but they're very consistent at the same time. So don't worry about, oh my gosh, if I uh, uh, make them wait, they're going to leave me, you know. Try to bring balance in your life. You don't have to rush. You don't have to make someone wait that long. Being somewhere in the middle. Be extremely expressive. I'm seeing you being more expressive in the near future. And the blue color will excite you a lot. Which means that you've started to become more vocal and communicative. Your speech has become very clear. And a lot of people are able to understand what's going on with you through your speech. You can convince a lot of people through your work, through your speech. So there's a change in your speech communicator, uh, communication skills. Observe. I'm also seeing you're not talking much. You're rather believing in people's actions and not what they say. So you're going to observe a lot. Let's see if someone wants to send you a channel message. Scorpio, write out the comment sec uh, section. I won't talk much. I will observe more. I want to be more than friends. This is someone that may start off as friends with you. And I'm also seeing this is also another message that you should make more friends that, that are like-minded, that are social, that are on the same page as you are. Mature women. There's an older woman around whose birthday is on six or something to do with the number six here. Official person. You might meet this person through that older woman. That person is... Um, yeah, there's a possibility you can meet someone through an older woman and there will be a dating period that's going to begin. And that person is someone that is at a very high position at their work. Okay. Finances and career. You might meet this person through work or there's this possibility that your person is someone that is very, very successful with their work they could be into accounts they could be into income tax they could be into banking they could be into anything but this is something very authoritative and high position work okay and that is the person who is your soulmate that is the person that has romantic feelings so that is the person that's going to like literally sweep you off in no time let me confirm with the signs here most probable signs coming for my scorpio sagittarius Virgo and capricorn that's it aquarius and sagittarius again sagittarius is about predominantly coming in sagittarius capricorn virgo aquarius all right what else scorpio okay this is an advice for you you're not alone even if you're alone, I told you, you never feel lonely. You know why? Because you have angels around you that never let you be alone. You never feel alone because there's someone around you. Ancestors, angels that stand beside you to help you to get what you deserve. So pray for them. Pray for their enlightenment. Pray for their peace and happiness and thank them. Awakening. You're going through a spiritual awakening where you're realizing there's more to life than practical things. There's more to life. You're, you're becoming more spiritual. You're becoming more new energetic very different person with a different mindset expanded vision of life i see the advice for you scorpio we have unconventionality you should be really respectful towards the talent that you have been bestowed with by god you are very unique and uh, one of a kind and it is important for your life purpose it's okay to feel and be different from others all right are very different sometimes you do feel like i'm different i'm one of a kind because of the talents that you have a lot of people might feel envy and sometimes you don't like that but then be thankful that universe granted you with these beautiful 
uh, qualities like even if you're a very kind person and genuine you're intuitive or you're intelligent you're logical whatever it is it's your unique talent embrace it fully don't be embarrassed make time for self-care it's important that you keep giving yourself every now and then that pampering and care that you will be expecting from the other person okay so the color blue is coming out strongly lapis lazuli you can get it for me energized la peace relationships be more confident in relationships coming into your life you really want to get into a serious relationship you have to first help yourself before someone else comes in to help you scorpio right now i take care of myself each and every day every minute every hour thank you and then you're having look deep within your heart and you will feel my love my love for you is as deep as the ocean this is a kind of a person that you're going to receive and i give you that 100 percent assurity because i have it for myself as well so why not you everybody deserves this not just scorpio but yes this is happening so someone's love for you is going to be as deep as the ocean and it is like something beyond imagination and that can happen you never know how things are going to roll out. All you have to do, do is just to live for yourself first and be positive. Ace of Cups. Things are happening slowly though, but definitely they're happening. With the Ace of Cups, is immense amount of love that they're going to slowly open up um, their Pandora box where you will be shocked to see how much feelings they have for you. They're deep. Like I can't even say how much, but... This is way too deep that they feel for you. Very, very nice personality. They don't even want to rush you to things because they want to give you that time that you can think about things properly. And someone tries to rush things. They're always scared of making a mistake and you're realizing it and then leaving this person. So they're going to be slow. They really want to take you out to parties, dinners. You might meet this person through celebrations. So be a part of the social gathering as much as you can, which is beautiful because if you be like others, stay humble and kind, God will bless you with a lot more. Some of you could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, or a Libra as well. Any last messages? Then I'm going to move towards some charms as well. I'm going to do some charms. Yes, this is someone that's going to put a ring on your finger. And this is someone that is very rich and successful. Don't worry about that. This person could be a business person. You are a business person. And then the feathers and the universe and angels always there around. Clear quartz, you will have clarity of mind, which will help you to express your things clearly. You can get a clear quartz from me. I'm seeing success from all over the world. I mean, in your life, I'm seeing success from all the areas in your life. You're synergizing. You're becoming more focused and goal-oriented. And that is why your energy is amplifying. You could be attracting an Aquarius. Okay, these are certain names that I'm checking on. Someone's from Paris, Italy, France, Morocco, Mexico, places like these. I'm also seeing this is like solid foundation tower. This is like a solid one, solid foundation. So you guys will build a solid foundation. I'm seeing marriage here, ring here, X. Stop loving the X. Someone is a loner. You feel loner, but never alone. Uh, I mean, someone is alone but never feels lonely. Someone's name is Timothy, Tim, Tommy, Tom, um, Rachel, Ramona, Rayleigh, Eiffel Tower. Wow, Eiffel Tower in this Eiffel Tower. Someone is strongly from there. Or this is talking about romance, very romantic love. YouTube. Someone is a YouTuber here, or your person, or you, or you guys have met on YouTube, or you guys have, that's a little impossible, but you guys may be obsessed with YouTube. X is still watching you, but they will not make a solid move here. Role. Someone is in like acting, modeling stuff, and I'm also seeing money coming. Oh my gosh, this is a clear confirmatory thing. Money is falling over you. 
so make sure that you are working for it and try to avoid any kind of hex if there is anyone who's doing voodoo it will be backfiring them you can get for that um proton india america malaysia san diego hungary tibet taiwan lebanon new york france Mumbai, Vietnam, Holland, Tokyo, London, anywhere basically. So that's about it. I hope you've enjoyed this wonderful read. Scorpio, thank you for your time. Please do like, share, comment, and subscribe to our Enigma Scorpio channel.